Happy Monday, New Horizon. It's Pastor Mark, and I hope you had a fantastic Thanksgiving weekend. Hope you got some rest. Hope you got to do something sort of fun. Hope you ate plenty. You know, today is the last day of November. I don't know how that got here so quickly, but it is, and it's spitting snow. <laughs> Just like it oughta, you know. Here we go, friends. You know, yesterday, Sunday, was the first Sunday of Advent. Now, I wasn't raised in the church. I didn't know what Advent was all about, but I learned that traditionally it's held as this observation over four weeks prior to Christmas where we remember and re we rehearse the Jesus story. That's pretty cool. Here's why. Because when we do that, it stirs hope in our hearts. It's the promise of God fulfilled. And so yesterday in our message, it was very cool. We ran the length of the scriptures looking for the prophecy of the coming of Christ because the promises of God stir hope. And we began, man, we found that there was this promise, this glimpse of hope as far back as the third chapter of Genesis. Man, and then it runs all the way through the scriptures. Friends, it stirs hope when we hear what God is doing, what God promises to do. And I want you to know that hope today. Our God has us and he walks with us, friends. Now, we've got stuff in our life we're facing right now. We all know that, but we are not without hope. And that's awesome. We have hope because our hope has a name. His name is Jesus. So would you download our Advent guide from our website? Just click on it and you can print it out if you'd like or scroll down for the content. We'll even mail you a hard copy if you leave us your digits. We'd love to do that. Walk through daily scripture readings and look on Facebook for different ones at New Horizon and reading those scriptures. It's just a joy. Friends, we can celebrate Jesus anytime, anywhere. Let's do it this Christmas season, this Advent season. God bless you all. Hope to see you Sunday. Bye-bye.